of polishes and I change them over what I'm more likely to wear in winter and summer because I'm not going to wear dark shades in summer but it's coming to the end of August so I want to kind of start switching them up now and what I do is I'll keep out some of my lighter ones but then put out my whole winter collection and I do it twice a year I change them around Feb March time more March time because it's still winter but then I'll keep out some darker ones and then when it gets to summer I might put a couple more away that I don't like the darker ones I'm gonna have to just line an unflattering position I think because I've been holding this phone for an hour now so I just want to do that and I want to buy some new ones I bought I don't have it on I actually don't have any on I went out with none on today I want to paint my nails later see I just don't have the time for things and I know I've been home hours, I've been home two and a bit hours now. God, no, I'm not, I should have been home as long as I thought. I thought I'd been wasting my time for ages and I haven't. But I bought an OPI one and online, it's from the... Can't I can't remember what collection. Tahiti collection? Is that right? I don't know. And it looked... I can't remember what colour it looked. It looked a grey colour. Got it, put it on, it looked silver. Then in another light, it looked like an olivey khaki silver colour. I don't know what colour it is. I've, I've used it twice, so it is nice. I like it. I will keep that out because it, even though... Oh, it's from the Fiji collection. Even though it's from the Fiji collection, which is the current summer collection, or is it the spring collection? Either way... I feel like I could wear that in autumn winter because it's it says it's silver but it's more of a silvery grey khaki colour it's a very strange colour I don't know I think I might have had it on in a video I'm not sure so I will keep that out and I've just ordered one I think it's the shade that I wanted this sort of time last year or last October and I never got it and I ordered that and there's some other darker ones that I like the look of so I need to like go through all my colours and then kind of like if I've had them a long time just get rid and get new ones and I know that sounds like it's a waste of money but if you've had them a long time they do get thicker like those the speedy dry collection was my all-time favourite one and now it's just like no and it's like I got some from the new like the co co coconut infusion ones by Barry M. I got two of the shades. I got Popsicle, which is a pink colour. And I've only worn that once that I know of. And then I got Scuba, which is... Well, it looks like a sea green, so that's probably why it's called Scuba. I've worn that a few times, so... I can't... I was going to put that on, but... I know what I'm wearing for work tomorrow, and it would just totally clash. And I know you shouldn't like paint your nails to match your clothes, but I'm not putting a sea green colour on and wearing a nude pink blouse. Like, it's just going to look odd. So I don't know what colour I'm going to put on. I'm not, I could put popsicle on, but it, it's really in your face. What did I have on? Oh, I had that OPI one on. I can't even remember what it's called. I like the names of the OPI ones. So I feel like I'm going to throw out a lot of my collection. I'm not going to throw out my um, Essie ones because I want to buy more Essie ones. I've got an Essie one that I got given for Christmas and I've never used it because it's like a dark sky navy blue kind of nighttime blue with silver glitter in. And I feel like I need to put that on top of a solid dark blue. And that would look good. That's what I think it would look good. And I think it's called Starry Starry Night, which is that song by Don McLean, Vincent. I might listen to that in a minute. Um, but yeah, I just think like I can need a big clear out and that takes up a lot of room on there because I threw some out the other day and it made more room. But I just wanted to tidy them and my bathroom needs tidying. And I want to like go through the the cabinet in there because I threw a couple of things out the other day. I want to go like the 
sort the top out and then go through what's in it and I need to just stop buying more products or if I buy them put them to one side so I can use the ones that I've already got and then I want to have a quick tidy in my office, my office is okay and then my living room's a nightmare it's just a nightmare I've never even sorted my conservatory out and I've lived here for 18 months I've just never sorted it out and I just feel like I need to at least find out what's in the boxes that I've not unpacked but I just feel like I don't have any time and it's like I wanted to relax all day Saturday because I'm just <sighs> my head's not in a good place as well and I hate the fact that people are watching me I mean this channel and I know the footage that's going up isn't recent but people are still watching me and I don't know how I feel about that anymore like ever since April I've just felt differently and I can't even put into words how I feel but it's just made me feel differently about being seen by people even in general day to day life it's, it's hard for me to go out in public and even go to work and people see me the way I'm feeling and I shouldn't feel like this now it's nearly four months ago and I just feel shocking like I just feel shocking <sighs> And you're not even going to know I feel this way for months because the next video you're going to see is from May if I let it go live and I don't think I will then you're going to see at least three videos from the 10th of June and then two videos maybe three from the 11th of June so I feel like all of September you're just going to be watching June then October you're probably going to be watching July and then November you might be finding out how I'm feeling now in August. I don't know how it's going to work. But I don't feel great anymore. I never felt great anyway, but what happened in April is just... I don't even know how to... Because I can't even talk about it, but... Um, every day is a struggle and I've gone out and got a job and it's just hard I just feel like I don't have any time to myself anymore it's like I get up early in the morning and it's like the second I get up I don't have any time to myself. I try to let myself have a little bit longer in bed like to try and get a bit more sleep so that means when my alarm goes off I have to get straight up I can't go on YouTube and watch something to ease how I'm feeling, I just have to get up um, and then um, I have to go downstairs and I have to have breakfast and I can't drink as much as I want to because I'll need the toilet as soon as I get there and I can't, I have to sit there for four hours needing the toilet and then I leave and I go to the shop and then I come home and I'm so mentally drained for being around people like I shouldn't even feel this way I used to be around more people last year and it, I never felt this way. I just, every since April, I just feel like shit. And I'm just trying to kind of be normal. And... I don't want to give up because I know I'll regret it, but I want to. Quit so bad, and I don't know what's worse like being in the house all day on my own or being around people and going to work. And I 
trying to put on this like like I don't know like I stand up for myself when I probably shouldn't do at work because I don't agree with a lot of things and I just won't be pushed around anymore and I'm just not happy and I'm trying so hard and no one knows how much I'm struggling and I just go to work and I put on this I'm okay face and I get on with my work and I leave and like I said I go to the shop and when I come home I'm just so drained that I can't, I don't even have the strength to go for a drive anymore, like, I just can't go for a drive anymore, it's like, impossible, I've not been for weeks and I need a new location. <sighs>